Well, good morning and welcome to the dedication program of the Midlothian Elementary School Historical Marker. My name is Diane Mallory Coble. I am a student of this school. It has been so wonderful seeing so many of us back in this building today and knowing that these walls are talking and celebrating and oh my goodness, the stories that are, are here to be shared and this is the beginning of sharing that story. Without the special dedication of Deja Williams, a rising senior at Thomasdale High School, and her absolutely young at heart mentor, Audrey Ross, who's a former student of Midlothian Elementary and a proud representative of the Historical Society, the Chesterfield Historical Society, it's been their combined passion for history and knowledge that culminated in this historical marker that we'll see today. They recognized that this was not just a building, but it represented a real evidence of community that we have here. This is a homecoming. And so we should celebrate as a homecoming and recognize the not only the power that, that occurred in this school while it was in session, but the power that it has in our community today. If I can encourage you to make sure people know the story in the community, that our children that are in schools now know the legacy, because this is just the start of telling people how great the school was and our community and the people that are here. When the brand new Midlothian Elementary School was open, it was an answer to our prayers. Our walking days were over and we had our own yellow school bus, like the other children. This beautiful school welcomed us. The teachers welcomed us. Everything was clean and shiny and new. We were proud. Our teachers and staff were proud. Our parents were proud. The community was proud. Midlothian Elementary School has a legacy of achievements that has continued for over 150 years and has provided a journey that has been long but well-traveled. The history of Midlothian Elementary School is so rich and the achievements of our forefathers and also those who follow is incredible. There is so much that has never been uncovered that is necessary to know the true history of our school and provide an appreciation by all of the accomplishments made and continue to be made and inspired by persons like Ms. Deja Williams. The marker being dedicated shortly is not merely a plaque to commemorate the students who roamed these halls 50 years ago. This marker signifies the glory of education for all. Projects like this one aid in bringing people together by encouraging, uplifting, and educating all in the community. As a student of Chesterfield County Schools, doing this project has opened my eyes by personalizing history by bringing it closer to my own backyard and teaching me not only the importance, but the strength in collaboration. The unveiling and dedication today is not the end, but it is merely the first step on a path to a brighter future, where we all make the world a better place as brothers and sisters to one another. Thank you. This building is still being used Monday through Friday, 8 to 4, for learning. And I would say even to a, a marginalized population that when you're um, after retirement, you may not have the opportunity to learn anywhere that you want to go. But here, this building has always been a place of learning for all. It means that the state of Virginia has recognized the historical significance of this area. And I, I, you know, for so long, for so long, it was a thing that, you know, oh yeah, this is off me open pipe, so it doesn't even exist or whatever. But, you know, hey, now the world will know that it does exist.
And I am feeling it today. I am feeling it. When we were in that room, that's where we used to have lunch. And Miss Jefferson made the best lunches and the best rolls in the world. And so I was feeling that. The music we took, the classes we took, the teachers. I can name every teacher that was in this building. And my aunt, who raised me, the principal of this building, Catherine Mallory Scott. I know, I know they are all smiling down today. Oftentimes, stories of integration and the civil rights movement can seem so far away, but by having the marker here, it shows that this was happening everywhere, and it's important to remember that history, but also for the students who were there in 1969, who were walking in the hallways and going through integration themselves, and for future generations to learn about it as well.